This is one of the newest arrivals in the e-scooter market that was first unveiled to the public just in May 2019. The Gogoro 3 represents the third generation of electric vehicles from the Taiwanese brand and it gets significantly improved and specifications compared to the older models. The new Gogoro comes powered by a 6 kilowatt motor and depending on the modification has a maximum speed of 51 or 53 miles per hour. It gets a new generation Panasonic battery that is also used by Tesla Model 3. It improves the scooter's range to 106 miles. Plus, the vehicle now starts using a key card called the IQ system. This Taiwanese manufacturer specializes in gasoline scooters and all-terrain capable quadricycles. And recently, it added its first all-electric two-wheeler to the lineup. In addition to developing the EV itself, the company presented a complex charging infrastructure that is supposed to make us forget about range anxiety. Their scooter was engineered to hold three battery packs, a non-removable core pack, and two external packs. The external batteries can be removed and charged at home or rented at branded charging stations. With all three installed, the total range of the model is expected to reach 125 miles. This all-electric scooter was designed by the Indian manufacturer completely from scratch, including such components like its motor, battery, and software. The scooter's build features a monoshock suspension for comfortable ride even on rough roads, a combined braking system for precise braking, and a low center of gravity for exceptional handling in busy city traffic. Its brushless DC electric motor has three modes which alternate performance and efficiency settings, providing you with either more speed or more miles of range. In addition, the model recently received a FAME 2 certification and now costs $70 less due to increased amount of government subsidy. The new PCX is the first all-electric scooter that was developed by the Honda Motor Company. The model's 4 kilowatt electric motor is powered by a Honda Mobile Power Pack, which consists of two battery units good for one kilowatt hour. As a result, the PCX is expected to deliver up to 25 miles of riding on a charge. Just like many other electric scooter manufacturers made their batteries removable, thus contributing to easier and more convenient charging. For those who are not ready to go all electric yet, this scooter is also available in a hybrid version.
Previously known as Bolt Mobility, Et Ergo is a Dutch electric vehicle startup that is preparing to roll out its first e-scooter model. Being one of the smartest EVs out there, the new app scooter comes equipped with a 7-inch touchscreen cockpit and a handlebar controls that lets you manage your smart devices on the go without taking your eyes off the road. The scooter also has an efficient drivetrain and a modular battery pack system capable of providing up to 150 miles of range when all three batteries are installed. On the road, the model is expected to feel quite agile, developing the max speed of 28 miles per hour in under 4 seconds. Quadro Vehicle Company have announced their partnership with Zero Motorcycles that resulted in the creation of an electrified version of their four-wheel scooter. Not only will the electric model produce no emissions, it will also provide a hefty performance boost. With an electric motor rated at 45 kilowatts of peak power and 80 foot-pounds of torque, this vehicle will show performance similar to that of a 650cc maxi scooter. The riding autonomy will be around 90 miles and the full charging time is said to take about 6 hours. The updated scooter lineup from this German manufacturer was presented back in 2018 at the International Motorcycle Trade Fair in Milan. It received the name RI, featuring two improved retro models. The regular 1954 RI scooter features a less powerful 4 kilowatt motor, while its sport version is fitted with 7 kilowatt motor, allowing for a maximum speed of 62 miles per hour. Both vehicles get equipped with up to three new generation removable batteries. When it comes to getting the maximum range, the base version offers more advantages as it delivers up to 116 miles on a charge compared to 75 miles for the RIS scooter. This full-size two-seater electric scooter is presented by the manufacturer as a smart and maneuverable alternative to a car for urban commuting. It has three wheels to ensure better handling and riding stability, an 8-kilowatt electric motor, and a complex battery system. This system consists of five removable batteries with plug-and-play connectors. It can withstand colder weather conditions and provide up to 75 miles of range. This powertrain nets 250 foot-pounds of torque and can accelerate the vehicle to speeds up to 60 miles per hour. The scooter is good for two passengers, requires no helmets, and has three-point seatbelts and seats with back support.
Currently, the only electric production model offered by Harley is the Livewire Motorcycles that is scheduled to hit the market in August 2019. The company, however, has already announced plans to unveil four new lightweight electric models between 2020 and 2022. One of them is an all-electric city scooter that was previewed by a concept vehicle tested this January in Aspen. The model intends to offer agile and easy-to-maneuver experience and attract younger riders who want a vehicle that does not require a motorcycle license and features simple twist-and-go operation. It is also equipped with battery swap technology that will contribute to having a hassle-free charging experience. 